Good morning, everybody. I'd like to thank y'all for coming out today for Palmetto Electric's Virtual Safety Days. Um, I'm Brian Blight, and today I want to talk to you guys about PPE and what it is to be safe at the co-op and how we perform our jobs safely every day and the tools that uh, we use to do that. So, uh, first off, to get started this morning, I'd like, you guys, like to let you guys know that um, I work in a substation to help provide power and also use equipment such as buck truck to restore power to keep everybody nice and cool on hot days like today and uh, let you play video games when you're in the house or maybe watch your favorite movie. And these are the tools that we use every day to uh, perform those tasks and keep us safe when we come home we can play those games with y'all. Um, but I also like to let you guys too know Palmo Electric is more than just what you see right here. To make all this happen, there's a lot of jobs that um, Going to it to help this happen. Um, if you like being on the radio one day, we have people who speak on the radio. We have people who work on computers all day. We have people who do line work. We have people who do social media and outlets and magazines. So Palmetto is great. You just need to do, there's a lot of things go on to make this happen. So there's a lot of opportunities for everybody. So just um, think about it and talk about it. But today we're gonna talk about safety a little bit. So we have tools that help us um, handle electricity. Electricity is something that you always can't see, but it's always present. It's always there, and you always have to be very conscious of what you're doing and making sure you're using the right tools. And to start with, every day, no matter what we're doing, we always have our hard hat on. Hard hat protects us from things falling from above, from us bending over. Um, and a lot of times, maybe you're through the woods, you walk a line out, you got tree branches and stuff. It protects you from. Uh, head injuries, get scrapes and cuts and things like that. Now also, of course, we only have two eyes and that's all we have. So everything we always do, we have special um, safety glasses. We have safety glasses for the daytime such as these. Um, they are rated for, uh, to keep objects from um, cracking your lenses and hitting your eyes and keep you safe. But also at night, you know, we still gotta keep our eyes safe at night. So we have special glasses we switch over to our clear glasses see better, we stay safe, but also protect our eyes still. And while we're talking about nighttime also, when you're working at dark, you gotta see, but also people need to see YouTube, because a lot of times you guys notice a lot of our stuff is by the road, or people's backyards, or anywhere. So help us to see and be seen. Um, Palmetto's provide a special equipment such as this light here, that we can use the folks to see where we're working at, but also to let people see where we're at too, so that keeps us safe. Um, Anytime we mess with electricity, we have special gloves that we wear. We have what we call our low voltage gloves when we're messing with the type of electricity that's in your house and around. But also we have special gloves too that when we're messing with the, the big lines you see outside in the air. And these rubber gloves here are a little thicker. These actually allow us to put them on and be able to handle electricity without it um, coming in contact with our body. But, and to take care of our PPE, Every day we do special checks. We'll take our gloves, pull them out and inspect them, make sure there's no holes. Because electricity will find a little hole and try to get to you to get the ground. We do air checks to make sure it's safe, there's no air leakage. And we also do a visual inspection on our gloves to make sure they're, they're safe and able to protect our rubber gloves. Um, also too, I know I've said PPE, and maybe I didn't clarify what PPE is. PPE is our personal protective equipment. Those are things that we use every day to make sure that we stay home, uh, stay safe, that we come home to y'all guys. Um, also, different situations requires different levels of protection. If we go inside of a, cl a closure to where we have a really high voltage system, we'll put these sleeves on. These sleeves actually protect us our, up to our shoulders. So we're always very aware of where we're at and what we're doing. But in case we do turn sideways or something gets loose, we are still protected from our arms through these right here. Um, you know, a lot of times our work may be in a bucket, it may be in the, on the ground, or it may be in a hole, or it may be in somebody's closet or a business or something. Well, electricity, if something does go wrong, it likes to come out fast, it comes out very fast at you. So if we're doing things in certain situations to where we are inside an enclosed area, we have this special um, mask that will go onto our hard hat like this and protect our whole face. And that being said, with our face being protected, also we have special clothes on that in case something does happen, these clothes don't burn 
Joe Mel, it protects our whole body. Everything that we wear it protects us every single day. From our top of our head, to our shirts, to our special pants, to our special shoes we also require to wear every day to keep us safe. Our shoes have steel toes in them in case we drop something. They have special soles on the bottom to stop like trees and penetrate and have a better grip. Uh, all these things come every day but they allow us to come back home to y'all. They're very important. Um, there's things that typically people don't see um, the part of our job. But um, this is everything that we use every day, our PPE equipment, to make sure we stay safe and uh, come back home to y'all. Guys, I uh, hope you guys are having a great summer. Enjoy your time, use air conditioning, enjoy your games, but please stay safe. And uh, just remember your linemen and stay away from down lines. Thank you.